Uh, this is an uncivilized book review, um, and the book I have today is called The Seven Generations and the Seven Grandfather Teachings by James uh, Vukalik. I hope I'm saying that right, and his um, Nishinaabek name, uh, Kage Gabo. Kage Gabo. Hopefully I said that right, um, James, so uh, don't know how to say that. Um, my uh, Ojibwem uh, Pangi at the go. Not very good. I only have a little, but uh, miigwech uh, for the book. And I, I love to watch James. Here's actually his uh, picture on the back. He is um, a descendant of Turtle Mountain. He does this really cool uh, YouTube channel, and I guess it's on the other social media called the uh, Ojibwe uh, Word of the Day. So I use that a lot. Um, that's how I started watching him, the Ojibwe Word of the Day. It's a, to practice a little bit and then just recently just this month actually July 2023 he released this book it's about the uh, the seven grandfather teachings and the seven generations uh, I just got it I read it the other day it's awesome um, I like everything he does the um, <clears throat> well like it says on the back here the uh, discover the profound wisdom of the Anishinaabe Ojibwe and people um, in the seven generations seven grandfather teachings in this captivating journey, you will immerse yourself in timeless teachings that illuminate the way of interconnectedness and interdependence. Uh, as the spiritual translation of the sacred laws, the seven grandfather teachings guide us uh, toward Mino Bima Dizuin, the good life, a life of harmony, free from contradiction or conflict, which uh, sounds very much like uh, uh, eudaimonia, which is the Greek term that we use for a life that is uh, uh, joyful, uh, serene, and full of um, enthusiasm. So the seven generations idea is the, the Anishinaabe used to say anytime you made a decision to consider how that's going to affect the next seven generations. So it taught, uh, kept them in mindful of things they did not to be selfish but think about their great 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 grandchildren how it will affect them. This is a great book. It's a very small, it's a quick read. Anybody interested in Native American culture or First Nations, uh, the Anishinaabe especially, uh, great read, real short, super interesting. I can't recommend it highly enough. And um, check out James uh, Ojibwe, uh, Ojibwe Word of the Day channel on YouTube. So, uh, miigwech. Thanks for the book. And uh, that's it.